Hey, what's going on today? I've got a haul from a local 55 plus community thrift store. I like to go here occasionally. It's kind of hit or miss. Sometimes I find retro figures, hats, clothes. It all depends. Sometimes I don't find anything at all, but decided to go today because I had to go pick up some groceries for the family. So I'm going to go ahead and show you what I got. So I ended up paying $18.81. For the most part, these figures were a dollar a piece. One of them was 50 cents. I'll show you more or less what I got here right now. So the first item here are some Call of Duty figures. At least that's what they put on it. Not sure if this is from the person that donated these items. But uh, they probably are Call of Duty figures. So we're, we're in September right now. So this is dated August. Again, I'm surprised some of this stuff is still there. I mean, for a dollar, I really couldn't pass it up. So this, I didn't know what it was. It said CD Project. I had to go look up online. Uh, these are like McFarlane figures for Cyberpunk 2077. Not sure if this one is as well, um, but I know this one is because I saw him on there. He kind of looks like uh, Keanu Reeves. Keanu, Mr. Mr. Berserker there. So he is missing his hand, unfortunately. There was no accessory with any of these figures that uh, came in this lot. So this is an old school Loki figure. There is a little bit of wear here on his chest, but for $1, I thought it was a great buy. Next figure here is Shang-Chi. I unfortunately realized that he's missing part of his, what, bandana. But a uh, dollar, still a pretty good price. I think uh, I was looking at an eBay listing and somebody was trying to sell just the body for like 25 bucks. But I definitely think that this is probably the more desirable figure as opposed to like the movie version one. But cool to add that one to the collection. Very happy to find this. Uh, both figures, two bucks total. So that is Ghost and that's uh, Luis. Uh, no accessories again, but for two bucks, that was awesome. Next figure here, this one was 50 cents and I'm going to show you why. Because he's missing his hand. Still an awesome Marvel Legends figure. I will have to clean it up a little bit. This kind of reminds me more of uh, McFarlane's uh, version of Hydro Man and ASM 315. I think the older versions or other versions of Hydro Man, they kind of made him a little chunky or portly. But uh, cool. Glad to have that one. This one here, we, we've got Marty. Back to the Future. Michael J. Fox. He was a dollar. This is a, a NECA figure, obviously. No no accessories. He will he will have to clean up a little bit here. But uh, never had this figure or any other figures from that series. So another addition. And this here I thought was probably like one of the better buys, I guess. Um, $7. These are Star Wars Black Series Troopers. And there's seven figures here. No accessories. Uh, thankfully, um, all of their limbs and parts are there. But seven bucks, dollar a piece. I thought this was a great haul. Again, this was only eighteen dollars eighty-one cents. Again, dollar a piece, except for Hydro Man, who was fifty cents. So, again, that's pretty much it. That's my haul. I hope you enjoyed the video. Thank you for watching. Take care. Bye.